In this video, we are going to look into how to transform a variable. For instance, in this data, I've got the CSR skill, CSR 1, 2, up until CSR 8. But normally, when we are doing our analysis, we are actually interested in an overall score for CSR. Similarly, overall score for CL satisfaction or any variable that is in your study. Now, how to do this in Blue Sky Statistics? What you need to do is just go into data and you are looking to compute a new variable. Data, compute new variable, click compute. So if you are creating a new variable, you have to name it. Let's name it CSR underscore composite for C or C for composite. And the next is you have to add your variables here. Now, How do I do this? What you need to do is you need to perform some arithmetic operations just just the way you write in a, a normal notebook so CSR 1 add the plus sign CSR 2 CSR 3 just make sure you add the plus sign otherwise it will give you an error 4 5 6 7 and eight. Now you are what you are doing is you are taking the mean score for these items to represent the underlying construct CSR. So close this parenthetical bracket. How many items were there? Eight items. So you've added eight. So this will give you the mean score. CSR one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight divided by eight. This will give you the score for or overall mean score for CSR. Just press OK. And here it is. You can go to just minimize it. Go to variables. Go right in the end, and you've got your new variable here, CSR. If you want to look into the variable, just click here or go in the end. So I've got a large data set, so I have to press this last here. Here is the mean score for CSR. The composite score for CSR. Similarly, you can do this for all your other variables in the study. Now, there is another thing that one can do or one might need to do. For example, I've got this age variable here. If I take the frequencies for this variable, now here is the table. This does not make sense. So what if I need this table to be transformed into uh, a categorical variable and then represented as frequencies, for example, age from 15 to 25 or age from 15 to 24, 25 to 30, uh, 34, 35 to 40. Uh, for, that will make much more sense because this paper, uh, this table now is not actually making any sense. So how do I transform this table into classes or how do I transform this age variable into group so in order to do this what you need to do is first obviously I need to find out what the minimum value is the minimum value is 15 the maximum value is 63 so let's say I can create the classes from 15 to 34 or 15 to 24 50 to 20 it's subjective whatever you fit seem or whatever seems feasible for your study so in this case I'm going to create uh, just to save time uh, two or three classes so in order to do this go to data and recode variables data recode variables okay I want to record age and now I'm going to obviously they'll create a new variable so I'm going to age underscore gr as the new variable name now here are the instructions on how to do it note string val values must be enclosed in double quotes and not in single quotes enter old value and new values separated by a comma for example male is equal to men comma female is equal to two these are just the examples or not available is equal to any if you want to transform the values for a particular variable you have to separate them by comma the old value will come first the new value will come second this is uh, a numerical example 
now we are interested here in range so range of values is supported for example 5 to 10 is equal to medium special values low and high may appear in the range for example low to, to 10 is equal to low 11 to 89 is equal to medium 9 to high is equal to high in this case what we are interested in is from 15 to 34 it will be 1 from 35 to 54 it will be 2 and from 55 to 74 it will be 3 this just mistake okay just make sure you've written it correctly the colon 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 looks all right press ok and go to variable view and you will see your new variable here now let's see the results analysis summary analysis frequency table i'm interested in age gr here it is now this much makes much more sense if you compare this particular table with the old table let's say age Now have a look at this table this was the old table now what we have done is we have transformed this table into something like this so this makes much more sense i hope the video would have helped you understand how to transform or recode variables in blue sky statistics thank you